Hey guys, it's me, Mavi Ashier. I got my microphone to work without me hearing myself, so that's good. And today I'm just going to show you guys how to make a game on Scratch. It's I'm going to make a game called You Can't Touch This, Try to Click Scratchy. Um, so I'm going to costumes. I wouldn't want to sh actually shrink him to like that size. That's eh, a little bit more. Alright, that's great. Okay. So, you want to make it so when you press space, it resets. So, what you want to do is event. Uh, when space key is pressed, uh, motion, glide, or you could just do set, uh, you could either do glide, or you could set, um, it to, where is it? Go to. Um, so, glide, I'm gonna do glide, because it makes it look better. Uh, I'm gonna do zero, zero, which is gonna be a center. Alright. So, when, when the space button is pressed, so let's click the green flag. When the space button is pressed, I'm gonna make it point two seconds. And we're going to copy or duplicate this and make it co not cost scripts events when green bars clicked okay so when this is clicked that okay and space is clicked yep all right now what we're gonna do um uh where is it when the sprite is clicked, we're gonna uh, we're going to let's see, we're going to make it uh oh yeah, so we're gonna do repeat ten times maybe, and then um I don't know, let's just make it turn. It's not going to go well. So, when you click them, repeat. Let's do 25 times. No, not. Let's do tw 20 times. So, let's. Oh, we should uh, also make him. Um, hmm, how do I do this? I forgot how to do this. I forgot how to do this. <laughs> this isn't like a tutorial. This is me like trying to do scratch. Uh, right here. Let's do boom. Let's do like nineteen times. So we want to go into that position again. So like 15, maybe. No. 17. And it goes, oh, we're close. 18. Let's just do it. 18. And then we'll set this to 180 this time. Ooh. Okay. That works. So when I click it. Okay. Alright. Alright, let's just do that now. Let's move that glide back to there. Alright, we fixed it. <laughs> Alright, but when we're gonna do events. Uh let's do I need to make it so like when the when touching mouse. I forgot where that is. I think it's in here. Uh, no, is it in here? Oh, touching mouse pointer, there it is. We're gonna do an if then statement. No, that's if then else. If, if then. Um, touching mouse pointer. 
is it gonna go in? Or is it is sensing like Hmm. Is this supposed to go? Sensing distance uh I feel like it oh is it in? There we go. If touching mouse pointer, then motion, I think. Uh, I thought it was green. Wait, hold on. Pick random from... Hmm. Then... Uh, I don't know how to do this. We'll say... Go, is it like go to random? <laughs> oh my gosh, I think I need to look up. Uh, we'll say, we'll just make it go into like a circle. Uh, hold on. We'll make it go. Uh. Here, so we'll start that, and then if touching mouse pointer, okay, let's click this, so it's running, okay, uh, I don't know. <laughs> um, maybe when the what other key can I do? Is it like press enter key? <coughs> I might actually need the enter key. And they press the uh. Okay, let's just not do this. Let's just do this. I, I don't know why this doesn't work. Like, so. Two seconds. If. If. Wait. This is weird. Don't hate me in the comments. Oh. Uh, when flag clicked. Glide point two seconds to X zero. X zero Y zero. If blank, hold on, what does it ha what happens if I don't do it? Like if I don't put any like key on it? No? Alright, I'll just save it and yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, that's it for part one, even though it's only been like 10 minutes. Yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.